What's up guys, Nolan here, and we got a new quest line started from Fence today, where when you complete it, you will be able to expand your stash. It's got a cool live action video from BSG where the lore is pretty spicy, so here is it in its entirety. Just skip ahead if you want to hear more about the event specifics and the lore. And while we're on the subject, the labs event has ended. You can no longer scav or get into labs free. Alright, here's the video from today, and skip ahead if you don't want to listen to it. Привет, служивый. Редко удается пообщаться лично с кем-то из ваших не контекста торговли, но дело важное, поэтому слушай. Мои работяги прочесывали ночью санаторий и так и не вернулись. Позже о третьих лиц я узнал, что они нашли какой-то хабар старый, времен, когда Терогрупп бежали с Таркова. Они тогда временно останавливались в санатории на переброску и оттуда дальше эвакуировались. Много каких документов в спешке позабыли, да и добра всякого. Так вот, судя по всему, это один из таких схронов оставленных, которые экскерные сековцы плохо закопали. По моим данным, работяги шли мне сообщить про находку, но судя по всему, их перехватили и накачали лекарствами, чтобы инфу выведать. Кто так умеет, мы все прекрасно знаем. Скорее всего, парни ему все выдали, но ссориться он не хочет с нами, поэтому отпустил их. Дальше обдолбанных их нашли отступники. И, конечно же, информация дошла до смотрителя. Тоже не самый приятный наш корифей. Все те, кто видел моих парней, говорят, что они не в себе. Рассказывают про какую-то бомбу и документы. Надо разобраться в этом деле. Работяг моих найти. Плюс, скорее всего, придется умаслить и ученого нашего, и смотрителя с его псом. Вряд ли им так сильно нужны эти документы. А у меня есть выход на тех, кому они будут интересны. Выполни все поручения и получишь от меня ништяков. Я не обижаю никогда. Ты знаешь. Я дам тебе мазевый шкаф для убежища. Сможешь схрон свой расширить на пару позиций. Бывай. Okay, so step one is to go find some scabs on Shoreline, which is found at the truck between Swap and Resort. All you have to do is walk through it, and then you'll have that step complete. Just make sure you know, of course, you, you leave the raid so that you can get into a new one. Step two is from Therapist, and that's to go back to that truck, kill two of the scabs there, those are the weird scabs, and then loot one of the new stems from them. As long as you kill two of the weird scabs and loot one of those stems, you're good to go, because as of the recording of this video, you do not not need to make it out alive with the stim you just need to loot one after you kill two of the weird scabs if that's changed check the description in the top comment i'll let you guys know there then step three is to go to lighthouse and grab a laptop from water treatment where this one you do need to survive it's found in the same container or the porta potty either on the floor or on the toilet in the container it's got a couple different spawns if you don't find it in the container or on the porta potty then check around the area there could be other spawns that we haven't found yet as of the recording of this video but it should be that because just Generally speaking, that is the checkpoint that is talked about. It should be at that checkpoint somewhere. We believe the next quest is time gated, so we'll see how long it takes to get to that next step. We'll check again in 12 hours and we'll also check again tomorrow. We think it's going to probably be 24 hours. Most of the time gated quests are 24 hours or longer. But because this started on a Friday, it seems to be matched up with pre wipe events and the goings on. We think it's going to be a day at most, so again, we'll check again tomorrow. In the video, Fence talks about his goons finding a secret Terra Group stash on Shoreline. When they were on their way back to tell Fence about it, they were intercepted by presumably Lightkeeper and then drugged while interrogated. After they were let go by Lightkeeper, surprisingly, they ran into Rose. The ones who were taken talk about bombs and documents in the Terra Group facility. So there is now a very real chance that this will lead us down that storyline that we all thought was crazy of Tarkov getting nuked or EMP'd. However, it's time gated, so we'll learn more tomorrow. We have reason to believe this quest line may involve a lightkeeper, so it may be required to have him unlocked. Unfortunately, I don't even have him unlocked, and I know... <laughs> like 90% if 95 or 99% of people out there don't have them unlocked. So it seems a little weird that they would do that in this case. Personally, once I know more, I will let you guys know, but it's not confirmed yet. And again, if you complete this quest, you will apparently be able to unlock new stash spots. We don't know if that's going to continue through the wipe or not like it does for ratings, which while we're on the subject, the top 10 people for ratings will get through and get the, uh, the two extra stash spots. Probably a bit too late to take part now for this current season, but just a reminder for next season, the top 10 people in each category will get the extra two stash bots.
This is one of the events that was found inside the ARRS terminal, which is actually still being worked on. To learn more about that, check out the video that I'm going to post later today in the next couple hours about the ARRS, what we found in it, and how you can use it and take part in the next event. Once it's live, I'll link it here as well. I'll put it in the description and I'll put it in the top comment. So there is very, it's practically guaranteed there's going to be more tomorrow, but as always, follow the Twitter and the Discord for the minute by minute stuff in case it pops up sooner, as well as just just tracking with the goings on of this event because I did pretty much live tweet it. I was able to get all the way up to part four before I had issues because I'm a bear. So it was a little bit difficult getting into the water treatment on top of the people just trying to go to water treatment in general. So anytime I get new information, I tweet it. So make sure you go follow the Twitter and join the Discord. And as always, like the video if you did, sub for more, comment what you think, and check out my other channels for other games right here. Thank you guys very much for watching and I hope you have a nice day. See you guys tomorrow.